First things first, what the heck are you wearing? Better to dress modest than be confused for a stripper. ¿Cuál es tu problema? We live in America, speak English. You talk a lot of crap. All I'm saying is that the street corner is calling your names. Hope you get paid for what you're worth. Since when do Christians call girls sluts? Pause. Did this heifer just try me? So she thinks because I believe in God, my vocabulary is limited? Just because I know Jesus does not keep me from wanting to cuss these dumb holes out. I did not call you a slut. I said you look like a stripper. There's a difference. And I'm not hiding behind Jesus. As a matter of fact, he's the only reason you're not on the ground right now. You know, one day you're gonna get knocked off your high horse porque tu corazón es feo. Hey, Carrie. Just because we were friends last year doesn't mean you can talk to me now. What? What do you mean? Before you judge my cousin or anyone else, you can go to hell. Jesus loves you! You're all sinners and you need to be saved! Repent! Talk for Jesus! Talk for Jesus! Give your heart to him today! Yes! Talk if you love Jesus! Yes! All eyes up here. This class is so boring. Girl, really? Mr. Hall is all that. Whatever. Excuse me, ladies. Am I interrupting something important? My bad, Mr. H. Okay, let's refocus. Everyone stand up. There was a time when you can look around the classroom and see that everyone had similar thoughts, similar morals, similar beliefs. But we are no longer living in that day. I look around this classroom and I see different culture, different beliefs, different morals. And that's what makes our room so special because we can come together and respect each other's differences. Mr. H, tengo una pregunta. See? Culture! Here we go. Talk to me, Megan. Respect is all we need, right? Respect is a good starting point. So, shoving your personal opinions and thoughts down someone else's throat counts as respect? Uh, well, it depends on one's posture when addressing others. Definitely like an I love Jesus, so clearly I'm better than you type of way. Everyone is allowed to have their own beliefs. But should you force them on others? Should you stand out in the streets and scream them at the top of your lungs? Turn from your Repent. wicked way! Narrow is the Repent. way! Wide is the gates to hell! You know what? You are really starting to get on my nerves. Okay, everyone, calm down. I've never rubbed my beliefs in their faces, and truthfully, I would prefer not to. They won't let me. Why? because I'm someone else to blame for their guilty conscience. Good morning, students. As you know, today is our back to school pet rally. Teachers, please bring your students down to the gymnasium for the pet rally. And remember, go Tigers! <laughs> 